back to the NFA Review Channel. As you just saw, we're doing a review on a takedown rifle today. Uh, that's something that we become accustomed to on my channel here, except that this one is chambered in 338 Lapua Magnum. So that's pretty awesome. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. All right, when you purchase the DRD Kavari, you have the option of, of the hard case that's custom cut, just as you see here or the tactical tailor backpack that you saw in the intro scene. All right, so we're gonna start from left to right, show you what it comes with. Obviously the upper and lower receiver, uh, magazine slot here, the barrel, the wrench that's used for assembly, the 17 inch rail. Uh, this slot is actually for a bipod, I believe. And this is where the suppressor goes. Uh, this is sp specifically cut for the um, Silencer Co. Big, big Bore which it does ship with that mount, we'll get to that in a minute, and a second 10 round mag. So that's what it comes with in the case. That being said, let's go ahead and assemble this bad boy. The Kavari assembles just like all the other rifles in the DRD lineup. Uh, to start, loosen the gas tube protector, set that aside. And then what you wanna do is line up the barrel extension tab and the gas tube in the hole, obviously with the notch cut out on the extension. Once the tab and the notch are aligned, go ahead and screw the, um, the nut all the way down till it's tight, and then use the wrench to ensure that it's tight. This is the only rifle in their lineup that you must use the wrench for. Once the barrel nut's tight, go ahead and slide the rail over. Ensure that it's fully seated next to the receiver and then push the retaining pin in and close the lever. Well, you know what it comes with. You know how to put it together. Now we're gonna dive down into the specifications on it. it. There's a lot, so I have a cheat sheet. The overall length is 47 inches. Uh, the barrel is 24 with a one in 10 twist. And starting from the rear, it comes with a Magpul PRS stock. Uh, it does have a, the upper and lower receiver is machined from 70, 70 75 aluminum as well as the 17 inch rail section. Uh, it does have three paint options, black, FDE, and battle worn for additional three, $300. It comes with the Magpul uh, ASR mount for their big bore. Uh, right now we have the A Atlas PSR bipod on it. Uh, so yeah, remember the case from earlier? That, that's where that goes. Um, let's see here, yep, fully ambidextrous controls and a side charging handle. Definitely a really neat rifle system. It's big. Well, now that you know everything about the rifle, we're gonna go ahead and show you how it shoots. Uh, over the last couple of weeks, we've been doing a lot of shooting with it. Uh, we got it sighted in, which took a considerable amount of money at six bucks a pop. However, really fun rifle to shoot, really smooth recoil impulse considering what it is. And it is a 338 Lapua Magnum, so it hits uh, hard at very long distances. So we're going to show you uh, how it groups under the one MOA guarantee, as well as some hits on steel at 500. Enjoy. <laughs> Hit. One more. <laughs> Ringing its bell, baby. <laughs> well, I hope everybody at home enjoyed the review. It's definitely a badass rifle. Uh, it held true to its claim of a one MOA group with the Pua factory ammo. We actually shot just under that. We were dealing with a lot of heat and, hum and humidity today, but we made it work. Um, so basically this rifle's, the main focus of the design on this rifle was for our armed forces. So a sniper team can get into position without any detection from the enemy. As you know, uh, when the insurgents see a sniper team, they put a higher priority on them. Uh, because they put such a, uh, a strain on their day-to-day -day operations, psychological and physical, when one of their head pops next to their buddies. So definitely a good, a good rifle. 
Um, we are we have one more review coming up, the CDR15 with the 300 blackout barrel. So that's going to be the next in the DRD lineup. So to see that video, make sure you subscribe on all my channels, and I will see you next time. Thanks.